In today's day and age of technology, the internet has changed our way of life. Almost everything we do involves the internet in some capacity, but for Tennesseans who live in rural parts of the state, getting access to high-speed internet can be a challenge. Internet providers have not been willing and sometimes financially able to install the materials needed for people in those rural areas to purchase broadband. But a new law recently signed by Governor Haslam called the Broadband Accessibility Act hopes to change that. Families who live in those rural areas hope this new law will finally give them access to something that is such a big part of their everyday lives, like Melissa Bryant of Robertson County. Um, I have two daughters who are in school. I have a husband who has a home office and I have a home office. And so we are maybe not even the typical family, but we are textbook, need high speed internet and have no access to it. One of the big things the Broadband Accessibility Act does is it deregulates the way internet is provided to customers. That way, people in the rural parts of the state can be provided internet through their local electric cooperatives, like Middle Tennessee Electric. Those uh, co-ops already have that infrastructure in rural areas. My home is served uh, by an electric cooperative. So if we can run along those poles already, uh, then we're doing a lot of good things. Other ways the Broadband Accessibility Act hopes to fill the gap is by providing grants to private providers to reach those rural areas and also providing grants to educate the public about the benefits of using broadband. Broadband isn't a want anymore, it's a need. Uh, for people, and especially millennials, uh, it is an absolute necessity and we need to start looking at it as a necessity. Only time will tell whether or not this act will connect Tennesseans to that necessity. Reporting in the Mid-State, Thomas Capps, MT10 News.